Do you have a philosophy of life um, that has guided your life? Uh, almost everyone does, but what, what, what is it for you? Mm -hmm. Is it possible to put it in a few words? I've got this amazing list of aphorisms. Uh, never acquire a lifestyle you're willing to sell your soul to keep. Um, never let an injustice become yesterday's news. And on and on and on and on. Mm -hmm, and, mm -hmm. and you know these are going to be easily absorbed and well, uh, adopted. Well, I'm struggling to find language for it, but, but the, the, the philosophy, I think, that um, really does guide me is that I will do well if I can just find ways to do good. And where does uh, that come from? Is that from family? A.L. Lewis, okay. Mary Frances Lewis Betts, John Thomas Betts Sr., mm -hmm. Aunt Nina, Grandma Betts, mm -hmm. all those folk. Because you saw A.L. Lewis doing well and doing good. Exactly. Suppose, what do you, I know it's counterfactual. Suppose you just see him doing well and he wasn't doing good. Do you think you'd be a different person? Yeah, substantially. Uh -oh. Substantially. Because you see, when I say well, Julian, this is important. I don't just mean material resources. There are some folk in this well, world who are doing very well and doing substantial evil, doing very well financially. Right. For me, doing well not only means a level of comfort, it means a level of peace, mm -hmm. a kind of inner peace. It means moving with a, a, a sense of joy. And so that kind of doing well only comes, I think, when you're doing good.